Eric Lima here. You're watching another episode of my YouTube vlog show 2018. Not only that, it is my second YouTube channel known as EML77 TV. It's episode number 38. I'm really um, excited. Um, just to let you know, I got a couple things from uh, eBay that just came in today. I'm really excited about getting them and hopefully I want to show them off to you guys and uh, hopefully uh, hope you guys get to enjoy them. All right, uh, they had a ROM hack of Super Mario Bros. 3. I saw this on YouTube, and I figured, well, let's let's find out if you know. I'm kind of curious because sometimes you never know what you can find on eBay. That's the fun part about eBay because you never know what you find on there. And you're like, oh my gosh, I want this thing. How much is it? Oh crap, I can't get it. You know what I'm saying? It's a, and check this out. Uh, Super Mario Bros. 3 mix. Saw this on YouTube, and I'm like, really? And I decided to pick it up, and I decided, well, found, found out where it was, and holy crap, I got it. So, can't wait to play this. This is going to be totally cool. Totally exciting. It's black. I like this. That's why it's black. That's the fun part. It is black. It has the thing on there. I just can't wait to try out Super Mario Bros. 3 mix, hopefully. And I got a 25th anniversary Power Rangers shirt in today. It's uh, uh, it's featuring the Green Ranger and the Dragon Zord. Tommy Oliver, the original OG Green Ranger. There it is. Green Ranger and Dragon Zord. Can't wait to wear it. So it's a... Ah, smells like a brand new t-shirt. New t-shirt smell. There you go. I'm wearing a, my Gold Ranger shirt. Hiya, you know. Um, <laughs> so I'm really excited about um, today. Uh, it's my vacation time. Watched WrestleMania last night. I get like if you if you want to know what my WrestleMania thoughts on, uh, just go to the last episode. I talked about a little bit about that. Like I said, it's okay, but you know, I just sit there and enjoy the product. And a lot of internet nerds, they always don't. It's like you know, they're trying to deter us from you know watching wrestling, and I think that's the problem, you know, with people. You know, um, you know, like oh, we don't like the WWE. We like all these other indies and all that good stuff. And oh, we don't want them in the WWE because oh, they're gonna ruin their talent or something like that. Well. Well, who knows for sure? And um, what you know, what is the main concern about Shinsuke Nakamura turning bad? Um, I think it will give him a new character, a new di dimension in his character because I think you're going to see Nakamura, you know, you know, really, really take off here. I, I've got a feeling, you know, he, he was very popular in, in Japan and all that, you know, and uh, I think the rivalry between him and AJ Styles we had like a we didn't have a, ma a major rivalries per se, and uh, so hopefully we'll turn something new. Now, we don't know what the situation of Brock Lesnar. He was supposed to lose the title because he was going back to uh, USC. I wonder if the contract was not up yet with the WWE. We'll find out for sure tonight on Raw because it was Raw after WrestleMania. Anything can happen. Craziness can, craziness can ensue and all that good stuff, and um, who knows? And uh, it is um, it is what it is, so we'll find out for sure. Um what what's going on like i said this is my first day of vacation and um uh, obviously if i was still working i would have been out by now but obviously and just because we have a lot of stuff going on my cousin tiffany's getting married in june i'm really excited about it um a lot of things are happening a lot you know a lot of things and, and the big change i was going to tell you about well it's not going to happen and i will explain when the time is right and uh now will be like I think at the end of the month I'll probably put up a video and say and tell tell what really, was really going on. I try to uh, you know keep everything in secret and I promised my family I would do so. But now that things have uh, now th now th uh, things fell through, I'll explain time time is right now doing in a respectful manner. So and I decided well like I said a lot of things have happened. You know it's been a rough uh, first three months of the year. We're already in April and. And we're trying to struggle of getting out of win of the winter weather type deal to get into spring weather, which I think it's heading toward that way in the weekend because I heard a couple of 60 degree weather. So it's, keep our fingers crossed on that one. I know we live in the South Coast and everything else, and live in New England. Hey, you know things happen. So hey, you know, I was told not to worry about the snow or anything like that. I think we're done with it. I think we're done with it. That's my personal opinion. So um, so that's it. That's all I want to talk about today. I know it's a short, short episode, and I'm always running out of things to talk about. But hopefully, hopefully during the week too, I'll probably um, attempt to um, play some video games on this thing. Play some video games. I got. Um, you know what's fun? You know, it, you know, you know what's fun? Like you want to go to the arcades 
You know, the Nintendo Classics thing, you know, Classic Case here, is a good thing. I always consider it a good thing. And it's like, okay, how, how are you going to play video games? Well, you can, play, you can go to the arcades. This is my arcades. Because I got in here four, you know, SD cards in here. Check this out. And they all contain video games. ROMs, emulators, and whatnot. So they're like, why bother going to the arcades when you can, what well, you got the arcades with you? You know, so like something like, you know, or, or, so how are you going to play video games? Well, they're in my back pocket. You know what I'm saying? Just the Raspberry Pi 3, thank God, you know, for the internet, they invented these things and just makes me put a smile on my face. And I can go, yay, I can play some video games. So I'm going to do that. So let's see what happens. So we'll see, let's see what happens this weekend. I'm kind of looking forward to find out what games I want to play. Well, I want to play the new Pepsi Invaders Coke wins game. Oh, wait, oh, wait. There you go. So, I can, I can end up doing that, but you never know. Um, we'll see what happens. I'll tell, uh, we'll see what happens. And after Raw, after WrestleMania, we got SmackDown after WrestleMania. And NXT after TakeOver. So, we'll see what happens on those. We'll see new fresh blood, you know, new, new comp competitors, um, returning competitors. Who knows who's going to show up where. Be very interesting. As you know, Detmark was going to have the second um, annual May Young Classic. I'm hoping to get Molina back for this one. And now I can see Tessa Blanchard make a return, get a contract with the company, and win the tournament as she should be with her man, Ricochet. The Undisputed Era's got a new era. They got a fourth member, Roderick Strong. We'll see what happens then. I'm sure Roddy Strong will probably talk about it NXT on um, this Wednesday. We'll find out. I got to pick out songs in the for my music ministry too. That's what I need to do. So that's it. That's all the time we have on the show. Um, episode um, number thirty eight is complete, and um, hopefully I can get you guys uh, on episode number thirty nine. Trying to uh, take things in stride here. Okay. See ya. Bye.